Idaho murders, Kaylee Goncalves Range Rover retrieved from city lot. Exclusive. An unidentified man retrieved Idaho murder victim Kaylee Goncalves Range Rover on Thursday afternoon from a Moscow city storage lot. The downcast-looking men helped a pair of Moscow police officers tinker under the hood as they started the engine of the 2016. Range Rover evoked that Goncalves excitedly purchased days before her slaying. As officers scraped ice from the windshield and brushed away snow, the sullen man, whom Fox News Digital wasn't immediately able to identify, paced nearby in the frigid air. At around 3 p.m., he drove off in the silver SUV nearly six weeks after Goncalves was killed in a rental home near the University of Idaho campus. Kaylee Goncalves, her best friend Madison, Maddie, Mojin, Sana Kernodal and Ethan Chapin were stabbed to death inside the King Road house between 3 a.m. and 4 a.m. on Nove. 13. The Range Rover was one of five cars towed from the property about three weeks ago. She just bought a brand new vehicle for herself, her first vehicle, Kaylee's mother Christy Goncalves told Fox News Lawrence Jones last month. She went home Friday to literally go show off her new vehicle. She was like, Maddie has to see my new ride. Like, she has to see this. And she was talking to Maddie the whole time going back and forth between the car she was buying. The luxury car symbolized the promising future that had awaited Kaylee, who was set to graduate in December, embark on a backpacking trip across Europe in January and start a well-paid marketing job in Austin, Texas, in February. She was a hard worker always having a full-time job on top of her studies even in high school, according to her obituary. Kaylee loved the nicer things in life and took a lot of pride in buying those things for herself. Police have not identified a suspect or recovered the large fixed blade knife they believe was used in the horrific attack that has left the small college town reeling from grief. The coroner said the victims were likely ambushed as they slept and each was stabbed multiple times. Investigators are asking the public for tips to help track down a white 2011 to 2013 Hyundai that was seen near the crime scene in the early morning hours of Nove. 13.